Last night I talked about my involvement in the development of a little microchip implant. And many people have already taken that microchip implant. The news media has talked about it being a good thing. And they will tell you that it's a good thing to have this. Your children won't ever get lost again. They won't be able to give you the wrong medication. They won't be able to, you won't be able to lose this thing. And so the plan is underway that you will receive it. I would be remiss if I came to you and didn't tell you that God's Word says, Don't you take it. No matter how nice they make it sound. Tonight in the science of technology, I'm going to be showing you some things. I want you to understand that there is a conditioning that is done in people. The television, I call it a Babylonian idiot box. On the television, you are being conditioned to accept certain things. There is one good thing on television. It is the off knob. Yes. Amen. Spend as much time, spend as much time in God's Word as you do watching the Babylonian idiot box. And God will speak to you through His Word. And so you are being very easily conditioned. I've been in 17 One World meetings. I was in Luxembourg with Henry Kissinger, George Schultz, and Bob Gates in a meeting. It was discussed there about the microchip. I was asked many questions, and I answered those questions. I've also asked God to forgive me for being in those meetings. They said, we'll make them aware of lost children. And so, after that meeting, on paper bags and milk cartons all over the United States, there were pictures of lost children. And then one day, all of those pictures disappeared. They aren't on the paper. A doctor inserts the microchip between your thumb and index finger using a device similar to a syringe. Now, these chips can actually be really helpful tools, and they utilize the same technology used in phone payments. With this tiny device, your body essentially becomes a contactless key. It can open doors using sensors and can even start a car. Are. They last anywhere from 10 to 20 years and can be removed with a small incision in the skin. Peace of blessings to the sincere, the elect, the 144,000. One third men, women, children, may the most high be with us always. Hear our prayers, accept our repentance, and deliver us from the hour of temptation and destruction. Shalom, man. You saw the video I just played for you. This is serious, man. It's not a joke, you hear me? It's not sleeping with white women. It's not an embargo. It's not a potato chip. It's not none of that bullshit these people who took the bag saying, you hear me? If you're an IUIC man and you can see this for yourself and see that this is what Revelation 13, 16 is talking about, get out of there quick, man. Because these people don't care about your salvation. You hear me? ISUPK, if you in that and you see this for yourself, man, you hear me? You got a dude talking about go get the jam, go get the jump shot. Hey, man, come on, man. Saying this sleeping with white women, get out of there, man. These people don't care about your salvation, bro. You know? When I first heard that this was the MOTB, I instantly knew it was. No if, ands, or buts about it. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and what it was, what it, what, what, before I came into the truth, I was listening to ISUPK first. You heard me? The Lord leading me to Great Millstone, man. You know what I'm saying? So, time for all the games to stop, man. These dudes sitting up there telling you that the MOTB is sin. How you supposed to buy and sell with sin? And the reason why we call it MOTB because they took our channels down and delete 
videos for saying uh, Mark of the Beast. That's the only time I say I'm saying MOTB. So we, you know, we say MOTB, you hear me? Revelation 13, 16, you know? So these guys are playing game, man. Games, if you in any of that, you in any of those groups, come out of that, man. Because they lead you right to destruction. If you take this chip, you're going to be destroyed, you hear me? You basically saying Esau, Esau, Edom is your is your power. That's what you're saying. Alright? This is the reason why we rehearse the righteous acts, man. To be able to prepare for the shit that's about to happen. You know? Like the day of atonement is a real beautiful day where you don't eat or drink. You hear I me? Mean? You pray to the Heavenly Father, asking for repentance, and you suffer, you afflict your soul. Well, the whole system is about to be linked to the MOTB, where when you don't take it, you're not gonna be able to buy or sell. You hear I me? Mean? So you gotta strictly depend on Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Harakal Kodash. You hear I me? Mean? You're supposed to put your full faith in the Lord anyway. You hear I me? Mean? Because this MOTB, it's gonna be for everything. You've seen it in the video right here, what I showed you. It's not gonna, it's not gonna just be for the open doors. Hear me? To get indoors and all that. No, it's gonna be for everything. Logging into your Facebook, logging into Instagram, logging into the uh, YouTube accounts, receiving money. It's gonna be on everything, man. When you go to Revelation, it's a lot for that train over my head, man. It's a lot here. It's a lot here. Revelation 13, 16, new, in in new international version. It also forced all people, great and small, rich and poor, free and slave, to receive a mark on their right hands or on their foreheads. All right? You got people that's simple as hell talking about, what if I get it in the butt cheek? Well, you're still going to be destroyed. You hear me? All the games is about to stop. The Lord is about to starve you niggas that's playing games, man. You hear me? You took the bag, you don't care about... Israel's salvation because that's what that's what it automatically is man you rather money over people's salvation man telling them that this right here is, is sin how you supposed to go in the store and buy with sin man yeah give me them snickers give me that snickers ball give me that flat screen tv you hear me with sin come on man get out of here when you look up these words in this in Revelation 13, 16, you hear me? Karagma, karagma, you know? When you look these words up, you will, you see. It's self-explanatory, you hear me? It's the proof in the pudding. But if you don't have the spirit of Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Harakot Kwadash, that's your kulo, man. That's your ass. You hear me? You in IUIC, ISUPK, get out of there, man. Emperor Nathaniel, <laughs> Emperor Nathaniel, Elder, Elder, <laughs> the elders had said that. You hear me? The comments call him Emperor Nate. Get out of there, man. Emperor Nate does not care about your salvation. He does not care, man. He took the bag. He don't even preach the names of the Lord no more. You hear me? Nah, it's, uh, it's Christ and all that. The Lord name is Yahweh. That's the Heavenly Father name. The only begotten Son, true name is Yahweh Shai, man. You hear me? That are, that's their names. And the excuse they like to use, well, they don't know Hebrew. Well, you didn't know it at first either. You learned it, didn't you? You hear me? We lost our heritage, our language, and everything, and we gaining it back now. The scripture says you have to know the, Lord, the, the, the name of the Lord, man. That's how you know when a nigga took the bag, they start switching up shit. Switching up doctrines, man. Alright? So the MOTB is gonna be used for everything. To get in apartments. They show you on these movies on Netflix. I, I ain't see the show, but I, I heard about it. Where uh, everything is through the computer. You know what I'm saying? They're going they, they, they trying to do that with everything. Man, you got Elon Musk with the Neuralink brain chipping. With these new I, I mean with these I robot robots he making. 
You're not gonna be able to do nothing without the modified D chips. You basically will have to go back to living like the uh, you know like the old like in the 90s, man. You remember the 80s and the 90s? No, no internet, <laughs> no cell phones. You know what I'm saying? You gotta say, man, hey, hey, hey man, forget them chips, man. You hear me? But the Lord ain't playing, man. The Lord is not playing. When you go through these scriptures, man, this is self-explanatory, all right? New Living Translation. He required everyone small and great, rich and poor, free and slave, to be given a mark on the right hand or in their forehead, all right? Because, hey, man, we still in captivity, right? This slavery, right? This hell we living in, you hear me? Small or great, whether you known or unknown, you know what I'm saying? Whether you the LeBron James or the regular rockhead up the street or whatever, whoever, man. You know what I'm saying? Rich and poor. It's self-explanatory. You read this and say, oh, that's what it means. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But you got to have the spirit of Yahweh by Shimei Yahweh Shai, man. You know? And Barak Adai Yahweh by Shimei Yahweh Shai, we know. And we're going to stay away from it. You know what I'm saying? Lord willing. When I actually, when you actually look at this, this shit creep me out, man. Look at this. They stick it in your hand. It just feel weird to me, you hear me? I already, I already don't like needles and shit. It's just, it's just weird, you know? Look at it. It look, it look, it look gross to me. And then it said, uh, this video, it said it lasts from 10 to 20 years. Like, come on, man. Like, look at the look at the interview with Evan Russo, man. He was saying everything, all right? He was saying everything of, of what their true agenda is with this. Complete control over you. That's what they want. You know, it was, it was just a lack of caring, you know? And that's just not who I was. It was just sort of like cold, you know? It was just like cold, you know? And, uh... I used to say to him, what, what's the point of all this? You have all the money in the world you need. You have all the power you need. What's the point? You know, what's the end goal? And he said the end goal is to get everybody chipped, to control the whole society. You hear me? What they say, they shall be like the most high? These proud devils, man. They want to chip the shit out of you, you hear me? Child support, take it out your check automatically. They already do that now, but it's going to be even worse with that shit. Income tax. All everything, you know, <laughs> they're gonna butt it. They're gonna they're gonna get the celebrities just like they're doing now with Kamala Harris. They're getting all the celebrities, Beyonce, Megan the Man Stallion, uh, who else? Magic Johnson, who else? Uh, Barack Obama. They're getting all these. Uh, uh, they're pulling out all their machine guns. You hear me? To try to get you to vote for Kamala Harris. Scripture said you ain't supposed to vote for none of them, man. They're not Israelites. Kamala, ha Kamala Harris is an Edomite. Donald Stump, he an Edomite. You know? But they, they, I, I, mentioned, I mentioned that to say that because they're going to try to chip people. They're going to get your top celebrities, your favorite uh, uh, so-called rappers, your favorite actress, your favorite actors, your favorite chefs. They're going to get all these people to butter you up and be like, oh, it's all right, get to get it, man. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna give you a free business. We're gonna give you a million dollar loan. We're gonna give you a million dollars on it. We're gonna give you a, a free uh, a gift certificate for Sam's Club. We're gonna put a, a million dollars on it. You ain't take it. You ain't gotta worry about your wallet. You know what I'm saying? And then this is how they're gonna use the. This is how they're gonna use the females. This is how they're gonna use the females. They're gonna hit them with. Well, look, tell your husband, you already took it. Well, tell your husband, get your husband to uh, come in here and take it. And you ain't got to worry about him so-called cheating on you because you can watch everything he do. We're going to put a chip in it that's, that's linked, linked, to your, linked to your chip and you ain't got to worry about it. You ain't got to worry. We can catch him cheating. And guess how fast she going to sign up for that chip. <coughs> you know what I'm saying? So we, we, we telling you ahead of time, man. 
prophecy. It's to say it before it happened. It's prophecy. All right? And we're warning you not to take this shit, man. You know? Not to take this chip. It's not a game, man. All praise you, how about Shimmy I was shy. King James Version. I'm going to end it right here. And you go to the Bible Hub and look at these, man. You hear me? <coughs> Salaki, I need some aqua, man. Revelation 13, 16, King James, and he calls it all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Keep reading, you hear me? No? Keep reading. Because it says, when you keep reading, it keeps saying, if you take this, you're going to be destroyed, man. You know, if you're a bu bubblehead nigga talking about, I'm going to die anyway. Well, you just, you just, you just, you just going to be destroyed then, man. Shalom.